Lisa Marie Presley was Elvis Presley's only daughter, but she had a half-brother from her mother Priscilla's most notable longtime relationship besides Elvis. Here's what we know about Priscilla's former paramour, Marco Garibaldi. Priscilla Presley divorced Elvis Presley all the way back in 1973. In all that time, she has never remarried. I really do value my, my, my private life. But that doesn't mean she spent her life alone. She dated Marco Garibaldi for more than two decades. According to Page Six, the pair met in 1984 and welcomed a son, Navarone Garibaldi, in March 1987. The couple stayed together until 2006. So who is Priscilla Presley's former longtime beau? And what do we know about him? Professionally, Marco Garibaldi has dipped his toe into a lot of different industries. According to IMDb, he was the director for three episodes of the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers TV series and the producer for the 2009 film Across the Hall. The Daily Mail describes Marco as a Brazilian screenwriter turned computer programmer, which is quite a career turn. Further, the outlet reports that he and Priscilla lived together in Beverly Hills during their relationship. Daily Mail reports that Marco also wrote for the series Dallas, which Presley starred in, and they actually met because he wrote a script he wanted her to read. The Daily Mail notes that it's believed Priscilla also had Marco sign an agreement at the start of their relationship that he wouldn't write a book about her if they broke up. Though the agreement was only rumored and never confirmed, there is indeed no book yet. The Hollywood Reporter credits Marco Garibaldi with launching Graceland merchandise into a thriving business, and his entrepreneurial spirit even led him to found his own production company, Godfather Entertainment, to make high-budget movies in a whole new way. He said, "...the studios are in business to spend money. I want to make movies for less and put every dime of it on the screen." In addition to the aforementioned Across the Hall, starring Brittany Murphy in 2009, the company's flagship project was a remake of Peter Sellers' cult classic, The Party. Jonathan Kesselman signed on to direct the film, according to Digital Spy, but it never made it to theaters because production was never completed. It is also unclear whether or not Godfather Entertainment is still operating. Marco keeps a low profile. One thing is for sure, he is a man of many different interests and talents, so who knows what industry he'll turn up in next. Priscilla Presley and Marco Garibaldi made sure that their son Navarone didn't feel the pressure of living under Elvis Presley's shadow. Priscilla told The Guardian that Navarone was independent of that, saying, "...he wants to do his own thing, and I'm really proud of him. He doesn't want to step into the spotlight, and he's always been that way. He's not riding on Elvis, and he's not riding on Lisa Marie Presley. We have never been Elvis this, Elvis that to our children, because otherwise you're building up something that is almost unreachable for them." Navarone married Elisa Achille in Switzerland in February 2022, and his mother was over the moon. Priscilla told People, "...they've been together for four years, and we've all been waiting patiently for this day." Even with their enthusiasm for Navarone's nuptials, Priscilla and Marco themselves never married. It seems she could say of Marco what she said of Elvis. To be honest, I think we were better not married. Navarone is 19 years younger than his half-sister Lisa Marie Presley. Their sibling relationship wasn't typical. After Lisa Marie died in January 2023, Navarone expressed his sorrow on Instagram, writing, Big sister, I hope you are now at peace and happy with your dad and your son by your side. But Navarone hinted at some difficulties between the two of them, adding, I know the past couple years weren't easy for you, and I wish things had been different between us. Regardless, you are my sister and I'm sending love and prayers for your journey home. I still can't believe this. I'm lost for words. Love you, sis. Bejos. Bejos is the Portuguese word for kisses.